Hey folks, what's up? Ashish here for Wearable Serena and today we are going to talk about some battery saving tips on your Android Wear Power smartwatch. So now, oh, what actually takes up your battery from your Android Wear? The three things. Vibration. The notification that shows up on your phone comes on your Android Wear and that takes up battery because it vibrates. Second, the display part. Now, every time your watch turns on, you interact with your watch, the battery is consumed. And lastly, the continuous Bluetooth connection. Now your watch is always connected to your phone, so Bluetooth is also taking energy. Maybe it's pretty less because Bluetooth 4.0, but it's still taking up watch because 24 hours connected to your phone. So how do you save a battery on your watch? Now before we actually go towards that, we should actually take a look on how you use your watch. Whether you use your watch as a smartphone or whether you use your watch as watch. So there are four scenarios uh, on this. The first one, you use your watch all the time, almost like any hours, and you get to see all notification that comes from your phone on your watch. In this scenario, your watch is going to last at the max of 12 hours. Second scenario, where you use your watch as a watch, so that's probably like uh, around 12 hours, but you get to see all notifications. In this case, your watch will have 30% of battery left by the time you reach home. Because when you reach home, you just take off your watch, like a watch, and then go ahead. Third scenario, you use your watch as a smartphone kind of stuff. So you have it all, all the time, but you have control on your notifications, you know, so that you get disturbed a little less. In this case, your watch is going to last pretty long, around like 15 to 18 hours. But if you are cut down on notification by 50%, the last and the best scenario is where you use your watch as a watch that's like 12 hours of scope and you use only important notification which gives you a battery life of almost like 24 hours but you still need to charge it by the end of the day because it's not going to survive for next day you still need your watch to be charged up so that said here is a few tips very basic tips that you all know if you are already using android way just about realizing it so the first thing is uh, never turn off your display of your watch because then you cannot actually just you know take a look at your time at a glance which we say almost all the time so if you really want to save battery for example if you are in a meeting or somewhere turn on airplane mode or simply disconnect your bluetooth connection from your watch and your phone phone that does the job second tip very important control notifications you get all notification that shows up on your uh, phone on your Android Wear. That's the really power of Android Wear. Any system notification, app notification, game notification, they all show up. So you should really control on that because then you will be looking at your watch all the time and that's really not a good idea. So control your notification, you save a lot of battery. Third tip, change the brightness. Now what I've seen is uh, in settings if you go there brightness level from 1 to 6. Now most of the time one works very smoothly at the max you can go for two for to be you know very comfortable. So don't put your brightness to six you know because it consumes a lot of battery then every time you look at your watch and then you know do some interaction with it or whatever but then you'll spend a lot of battery so make sure you do it at two or one at the max. Last tip use your watch as a watch it's not a smartphone your smartphone is always with you to see anything what's happening on the phone use this as an extension to your smartphone so when you go out you can actually see notification pick up calls uh, you get to see all the emails without picking up your phone that's the whole goal right now so make sure you are using your watch as a watch when you reach home take off your watch you know you go out, take your watch along with it and that's how it should work so those are the quick tips on how to use your android wear the way and it should save your battery life by a larger means than what you are doing correct please don't use it as your smartphone use it as a smart watch as an extension to your phone so thanks for watching and do like the video do give it a thumbs up if you really like the tips and share it with your friends who are having a smart watch and they are really uh, you know bothered about the battery life thanks